Arnie Slot is eyeing a move to sign a Premier League defender for £38 million, a player Jurgen Klopp also wanted. Liverpool has been in talks with the Premier League club to sign their amazing £60 million player. Exclusive. Liverpool has been told that a £50 million bid would be accepted. Hello Reds fans, welcome to your news channel for the greatest club in the world. A report revealed that Slot is considering signing Wolves defender Rayan 8 Nuri this summer. A new midfielder should be one of Liverpool's priorities. They need a number six to play alongside Alexis McAllister and Dominic Soboslai in midfield. Liverpool also needs to strengthen their defense. Joel Matip has left the club and needs replacing, while there are arguments that the Reds should also sign a new left back. Andy Robertson faced injury issues in the 2023 and 24 season, and there are doubts whether Costas Tsimikas is good enough to be the starter throughout the season. Joe Gomez could be the best option at left back right now. This is probably why Liverpool is interested in Wolves' Rayan 8 Nori. Give Me Sport reveals that Wolves' defender is now on Slot's radar, and Liverpool could sign 8 Nori without negotiating with Gary O'Neill's team. This is because reports suggest the 23-year-old left back has a release clause in his Wolves contract worth 45 million, which is just under 38 million. However, Liverpool faces competition from Manchester United. Eric Ten Hag also wants to sign Ait Nuri to solve his team's left-back problems this summer. Ait Nuri is not a new name to Liverpool fans. The talented Wolves defender has been on the Reds' radar for several years. Reports indicated in December 2021 that Liverpool was interested in signing Ait Nuri. This link resurfaced again in November 2023. Reports suggested Klopp was pushing to sign Ait Nuri from Wolves. The legendary German manager didn't manage to secure the transfer during his time at Anfield. But if Slot really wants to sign Eight Nori this summer, there's a good chance of success. However, it's still unclear whether Liverpool will convince the Wolves star to join them ahead of Manchester United in this transfer window. Dear fans, do you think signing Ray and Eight Nori would be crucial to strengthen Liverpool this season, especially after Joel Matip's departure and Andy Robertson's injuries? Another player being monitored by the Reds is Pedro Neto. Many believe the priority should be a new midfielder, although it can be argued that Liverpool should strengthen their defense. However, the player Liverpool is currently trying to sign is actually a forward. Give Me Sport revealed that Liverpool has contacted Wolves and Pedro Neto's agents about a possible transfer to Anfield this summer. It was stated that there is growing expectation that the winger's agent, Jorge Mendes, will push his client to secure a high-profile transfer in the coming weeks. Neto has been strongly linked with a move to Tottenham this summer. North London rivals Arsenal are also interested in Neto. The report states that Slot is seriously considering whether to make an offer to sign Neto, but the move won't come cheap. It's said that Wolves paid 60 million for their star forward, who still has three years left on his contract. Nito, regarded as amazing by Gary O'Neill, is open to leaving Wolves as he is interested in playing in the Champions League in the 2024 and 25 season. Does Liverpool really need Neto? Liverpool's strong point has always been their attack. The Reds have Mohamed Salah as a guaranteed starter on the right wing, while Luis Diaz, Cody Gakpo, and Diogo Jota share responsibilities on the other side of the field. Players like Harvey Elliott and young Ben Doak will also be available to slot in the 24 and 25 season. That makes it six different options for Liverpool, which raises the question of why they are interested in signing Nito this summer. However, Salah is already 32 years old and in the final year of his contract, while Elliott is more of a midfielder who can play wide than the other way around. Doak, still only 18, isn't ready to play week in, week out. This is probably why Liverpool is eyeing Nito, and if the price is right, we believe he would be a great signing for them this summer. I asked for your opinion on Ait Nuri. Now tell me here in the comments, your opinion on Liverpool's interest in Pedro Neto. Would you like to see this signing? Liverpool has been informed that they will need to make a $50 million offer to sign Juventus star Gleison Bremer, according to sources from Football Insider. The 27-year-old player has been identified as one of Anfield's main targets, especially now that the club prioritizes defensive reinforcements at the beginning of the summer transfer window. 
Since arriving at Torino in 2018 and subsequently transferring to Juventus in 2022, Bremer has excelled in Serie A. He and Gonzalo Inacio, also valued at $50 million, are among Liverpool's top options. Mark Guehi was another option on the list, but Liverpool was discouraged by Crystal Palace's high demands of $70 million, as revealed by Football Insider. The Reds have also been monitoring Inazio for some time, valuing his European experience at sporting. Liverpool is looking to make their first major signing of the summer and considers Bremer's experience with the Brazilian national team and his contract presence until June 2028. With Torino could strengthen the defense, especially with uncertainties surrounding Virgil van Dijk's contract, which ends in June 2025 and has sparked speculation about a possible departure in recent months. Liverpool is closely monitoring Juventus's Dean Hoysen during their US tour, considering hiring decisions to strengthen the defense, an area seen as a weak point by the team. Graeme Bailey, a journalist from Rousing the Cop, reports that the club sees Hoysen as a promising talent and a potential immediate starter. However, Hoysen seems interested in opportunities in the first team, which has led clubs like Bournemouth to lead the race for his signing. With the history of sporting director Tiago Pinto, who brought him on loan to Roma, Liverpool sees this as a potential benefit. Heidson is available for around $21 million this summer, a value considered attractive given his potential. At 19, he is slightly older than Lenny Yoro, but is seen as a high-quality defender. Considering this, Liverpool could consider bringing him in and, if not considering him an immediate starter, a loan for a year could be a viable option. While Bournemouth presses for the signing, Heidson seems to be evaluating other opportunities at more prestigious clubs. If Liverpool can guarantee him significant playing time, there is a real possibility of being the right place for his development. What do you think of Red's interest in Juventus's Dean Heidson? Do you think he would be a good addition to Liverpool's defense? Thank you very much for watching up until here. Until next time.